it's Andrew from Launch27 and in this video I want to show you how to add the special labeling to your booking form for when you have the exclude first booking from recurring discount setting enabled so um, first thing I'm going to do is show you that setting you want to go to your subdomain tab here and scroll down to recurring bookings now here's the setting it says frequency discount do you want to apply it to all bookings of a recurring appointment or exclude the first booking of a recurring appointment from that discount? And this is the one we want to choose. And the reason why people do this is because sometimes um, they want to make sure that uh, the, the customers charge full price for that first booking because maybe that first visit requires more effort um, or they want to prevent people from uh, trying to take advantage of the recurring discount and end up uh, canceling after the first booking is done. So this way, uh, the customer pays full price for the first booking, and after that, they get the discounted price. So let's go ahead and save this. Now you want to go to your booking form designer. Here we are on the on the um, premium booking form designer, and now you can see that we have these three total labels so if you click on this one that's already visible you can see that there's a description here describing that it's the fur it's the amount the customer will be charged so that's what this is the label that they see if they choose a regular frequency which like which is like one time right here you see I have four of them now the one time frequency here does not have any discounts associated so that this is the label that we show when that it doesn't have any uh, discounts and um, these other two are what we show if they choose a frequency that does have discounts so this one is uh, the amount that they will pay for the first service the description is right here and we want to make sure that this is unchecked so that it's visible and uh, you want to go to this one and this is what they will see this is what the amount they will be charged after the first service so again make this unchecked so that it's visible now and you can see that right here so the other thing you can do is if you wanted to include the name of the frequency in this label, you can do it by adding a placeholder here. Just put um, two squiggly brackets to open it, two squiggly brackets to close it. Type frequency, do it in lowercase, frequency dot name, and that will load the name of the, uh, the frequency that's selected. So you can see that the one time is selected here, so that's what it's showing here. So now, just click Save, and I'm going to show you what this looks like on the booking form next. So here's a preview of my booking form. Um, now, here I am on the frequencies. Everything looks normal because I have the one-time uh, frequency selected, but if I choose weekly, I will get a discount of this amount today's total I pay full price and on um, after that my normal total will be 10621 and um, that's about it if you have any questions please contact us at support at launch27.com thanks